Hi, welcome to SBR Videos. I'm Peter Loshak. We are uh, talking right now with Tony George from Tony George Sports Locker Room Picks.com and uh, his regular Yahoo Sports radio show, which is a must listen if you're awake at that time, uh, Saturday mornings and Sunday mornings. If you're not awake, then definitely it's more important to sleep. But if you're awake, definitely tune into uh, that show. And he's going to cover the Philly Arizona NFL game with us. Tony George, thanks for being back with us. Well, you better be awake at 11 a.m. Eastern on Sunday to get all the free <laughs> on Yahoo Sports Radio if. If you're not, you're not a sharp player. Put it that way, Peter. Yeah, I hear you. But look, in my experience, uh, you know, good information is the second most important thing when it comes to uh, picking winners. The first most important thing is being well rested and having a clear head. So yeah, <laughs> but absolutely, highly, highly recommend Tony George's. Uh, Yahoo Sports radio show Saturday and Sunday morning. All right, before we get to uh, your, your opinions on Philly, Arizona, just give us a general overview of what's going on right now at your websites uh, this, this, uh, this week, Tony. Well, Tony George Sports is a, a great website. If anybody wants to go over there, we got videos over there. Three play videos are on a nine and four run. We do some of our own videos too, Peter. They're not near as high end as yours, but nonetheless, uh, we, we put out some great content there. Murderers, Real Handicappers, Guaranteed Plays. So if you get a triple header and it doesn't go two and one, your next card's free. And, of course, uh, some great handicappers there. And Locker Room Picks, associated with the radio show, is an all-free content website with great uh, free pro picks there each and every weekend and a lot of great information as well. Okay, sounds great, Tony George. Well, you picked an interesting uh, NFL game here, Philly and Arizona. Right now, Arizona's a two-and-a-half-point home favorite. That's down from three. And Philly, of course, uh, is off the bye. They are five-and-one, although there's a lot of statistical reasons to believe that uh, they're maybe they're outplaying their statistics, their, uh, their, that their record is, is better than it should be and that they've outplayed their statistics. Uh, Arizona, though, you know, quality team. Uh, you know, Bruce Arians loves to pass, and Carson Palmer seems like he's okay right now. So a total of 48. I mean, at first glance, maybe it looks like it's looming a little bit low considering uh, we know what Philly likes to do and what Arizona likes to do. I guess uh, the main issue here is, is, is the, the rest and recuperation going to help Philly, at least for this game, and they come back and be able to uh, punch Arizona in the mouth? What do you like here, Tony? Well, I'd I like to ask you a question. Yeah. Um, uh, if you want to take a look at uh, two five and one teams here, you really want to scratch your head on rankings and statistics. I'm trying to figure out how Arizona is five and one. They're 31st against the pass now on defense. Now, you know that's doom in the NFL. Right. You know, and you're playing a team at seventh in passing, third in scoring. They're on a week off. They played a tougher schedule. And really, if you, if, if you throw out the San Diego win they had on the opening Monday night football game in the late game, if everybody remembers back, San Diego dominated that football game and screwed it up, lost by one point, you know, Arizona had no business winning that game, but sometimes it goes like that. They win by one point. So I kind of throw that out as a fluke. There's an asterisk beside that one. Mm -hmm. The only only quality team they beat in is San Francisco. Mm -hmm. And San Francisco was beat up when they went into that game that week as well. Uh, and they played them. But 28th in total yards. They won't, Arizona's only running the ball for 91 yards. I mean, you go down the list here. I think Philly's the better team. And the one thing I like about Philly and her Chip Kelly, six and two against the number of their last eight road games. Mm -hmm. And that's one thing I look for in NFL teams. And one, one key statistic other than turnover differential that you want to look at is how teams perform on the road against the number. You know, when Philly's one of the top teams in the league over the last year at going on the road and covering numbers, whether they're winning outright or covering as a dog, but uh, I like them here. I just think their passing game is going to be too much for Arizona. And that's what I like to call a false favorite. Mm -hmm. Now, this money line, this money move early in the week, as you know, we take these uh, midweek, you know, Peter, these videos here. And usually the early move is smart money move. Mm -hmm. The public comes in and moves these lines around. You had a lot of sharp guys taking Philly on that fall number of three. You know, because it's a, a three, six, seven, you know, 10, 13. Those are fall numbers that sharp players like to, you know, be on or use teasers to get through. And so uh, two, two things here. I like Philadelphia here to win straight up, so grab the point. Second of all, this would make a great front end of a two-team six-point teaser because you're going to tease them through three, through six, and through seven. You know, in, in a game that should be a good ball game here, but even though it's down in uh, – you know, Mesa, Arizona here. I like Philly all the way here. All right. Awesome analysis. Tony George from TonyGeorgeSports.com. Like in Philly, yeah.
plus two and a half is a currently widely available number, and that was my initial thought. Uh, just very quickly before we let you go, uh, do you think that the total is looming a little bit lower? Do you think that's kind of a trap? 48 is right now what, what the total is. You know what? I think that number is about right. Okay. I, I, I think, you know, Zona, you, I, I hear so much about the hype about their defense, Peter. Mm -hmm. But you start looking at their statistics and, you know, their inability to run the football, and you just wonder how in the world that's possible. But, you know, I, I think that uh, this, this total here, if anything, this very well could be one of those 23 20, uh, you know, 2014 type ball games mm -hmm. here. Everybody's thinking shootout. Right. You know, so, so the second I saw this total not at 50 or higher, right. Right. I knew right. there was a weasel in the wood pile, and I'm staying away from it. Tony uh, George from TonyGeorgeSports.com recommending play on Philly plus two and a half. Thanks so much, Tony. The SBR Network offers free sports picks and game breakdowns. Big money free betting contests year-round, a real-time Vegas-style odds monitoring service, and much more. So come see for yourself. To stay updated on SBR news and promotions, follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Google+. And do be sure to subscribe to the Sportsbook Review YouTube channel to catch all our daily sports shows.